girl. Okay, well, good stuff. Did we get everything else? So, yep. Okay, are you ready? Right here. Right here. Okay, that's all. Oh no, that's all. She's like, I forgive you for the toe pinch now. <laughs> so she's a little bit of a diva, like I said. Mm -hmm. Um she um what's interesting is she's she's uh, i didn't see so much i mean her confidence level is good but she takes her time to do things she's a thinker yes. she's always been a thinker mm -hmm. yeah you can see she thinks things through before she decides what she's going to do mm -hmm. um she's got plenty of play drive that's not a problem um though i would use the play to help her through her diva ishness. Mm -hmm. um, she actually didn't do much in the way of holding a grudge with me, surprisingly. But um, but I I could see that m most divas will. Mm -hmm. But um, the only thing you have to watch on divas is if you over diva them, they can become manipulative. Uh, particularly a thinking puppy like her, because that means she's going to be pretty smart. Mm -hmm. And she'll figure out, like, say she doesn't want to go get in the bathtub, she'll figure out if she just goes and does her little princess thing, she won't get put in the bathtub. Mm -hmm. So that's the... I, I actually love... Divas are typically great to live with, but you do have to assert uh, that some things have to happen anyways. Mm -hmm. That even little princesses have to go take their baths and things like that. Mm -hmm. And they don't need to chew on the carpet. Hey, 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 hey. No carpet chewing. She's very sweet, though. I mean, she's not looking for to be confrontational or anything like that. Mm -hmm. um, but um, um, very cute, very cute little girl. Come here. 
I have a feeling you're going to get held a lot at first. Huh. Very sweet. I kind of like the fact that she um, does take her time to do something. So like if somebody wanted to do therapy work with her or something, she'd be able to handle that slower, you know, everything needing to slow down a little bit kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Huh. Yeah. So what kind of homes do you have for the puppies? So we've got a sporting, potentially confo, a um, just medium drive, kind of laid back home. They live in Uray, um, so do some hiking and outdoor stuff. And then one with a veteran with some PTSD that needs a, a buddy. Depending on what the other two are like, she would probably be a good PTSD dog. Okay. Um, the only thing being that because she is a little bit of a diva, she if she's not happy doing whatever you're doing at the moment, she's she will be go off and play by herself. Yep, that's exactly how she is. <laughs> <laughs> but um, but uh, she's pretty cute though. <laughs>